Here's our top five video editing programs. Are you tired of scrolling through many, many different editing videos and still wondering which one you should use? Well, in this video, we're going to help you out. We present the top five video editing tools with the pros and the cons that will help you with that difficult decision. Number one. First up, we have DaVinci Resolve 17. This free program is used in Hollywood by studios and small companies alike. It's used across Mac, Windows and Linux, meaning that it's great for group projects, especially when everyone isn't running the same device. It supports up to 8K footage, which is a great feature if you're using a higher end camera. But it's not all perfect, unfortunately. Noise reduction and some great features are hidden behind DaVinci Resolve Studio 17. Though this is a one-time payment of £235, you may struggle with only losing advanced filters, effects, resolutions and frame rates. So it might be something to consider getting the more pricey option. Number 2. Now for Shotcut. This is a cross-platform video editing app. So if you use Windows, Linux, FreeBSD or Mac OS, you can use this app. It's also free and allows you to add any number of video tracks. It has a range of transitions that can be used as well as a range of review options, such as the editing view, the audio view, the color view, and many more. Using Shotcut requires moderate learning, but it is quite simple. On the downside, with Shotcut, you cannot preview the filters, and there's a lot of controls on Shotcut, so it is a little harder to learn. However, there are many resources online to help with navigating and getting used to the tools. The link to these tutorials will be in the description box below. Number 3 Adobe Premiere Rush is an all-in-one device used for creating and sharing online videos fast. It is available on macOS, Windows and on your phone and mobile too. You have access to use the unlimited free trial which includes 3 exports, all features to play with and up to 3 gigabytes of cloud storage. What's not to love? This is a very simple to use video editing app. However, this can be a negative too, as it's harder and more complicated videos are, let's say, troublesome to create sometimes. If you want, you can use the subscription fee that Adobe provides and get access to unlimited exports. But that's for you to decide after you've tried this great program. Number four. Here's iMovie. This is a great and easy video editing app. And the great thing about this software is you don't have to pay a penny because it's free. This video app is completely beginner friendly as you're able to figure out how to use it pretty quickly. If you wouldn't mind paying, there's an upgrade option called Final Cut Pro X. Now it is quite pricey at 299 pound 99 pence, but it does have advanced features that iMovie doesn't. So you can transfer to this once you've grasped the basics of iMovie. Now on the downside, the cons to iMovie is, it's only available for Mac OS, iOS and iPad OS devices, not for PCs. It also has limited features present compared to the other video editing tools. It doesn't support portrait videos, so for my Insta story lovers who want to be editing, iMovie may not be the best option for you. But if you use regular widescreen videos, it's got your back there. Number 5 Adobe Premiere Pro is an industry standard video editing tool. A fun fact is that Deadpool as well as Gone Girl were both edited completely using this package. Premiere Pro offers features which are great value for the price. This app is mostly great for professionals 
as it can be quite intimidating and confusing to any first time users. But you can quickly pick up tips and tricks online, especially on YouTube. The great thing about Premiere Pro is that it also supports VR editing tools, which some other options we've provided don't actually have. The cons to this app, however, is the price, specifically the fact you're on a subscription. But you can also get things like Premiere Rush included, and because the two apps are compatible, you can switch between the two on your singular subscription. And those were our top 5 video editing apps. Like, comment and subscribe down below. Thanks for tuning in. Oh, and stay tuned for the next video.